Hello traders, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily crypto market update and we will figure out is it still bullish trend or it's a bearish reversal on daily time frame. Let's move to 5 rules of risk management, please read it and follow it every single trade and you will be successful, now it's a time for trading view. Let's start from crypto heat map based on the market cap daily performance. A lot of red, a lot of red, a lot of red. Some still some of, of crypto still green, but generally 80%, 90% of red. It's a definitely bull, bearish reversal, right? Now let's uh let's move to my trading view setup. If you want to learn more about trading view setup, just go to the description. There is the link about trading view setup training and other links about all my trainings. Now let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using simple moving averages, white line SMA 200, purple line SMA 100, blue line SMA 50, yellow line SMA 20, red line SMA 10, green line SMA 5. Below, yellow line RSI line and high Kanachi bars. That's all. Very simple. It's not easy because emotions involved. If you follow the indicators, you will be successful. Now let me show you how it works. Look at that on my chart. You see green green circle. When MA5 did bullish crossover over 10 and, and over red and yellow, over 10 and 20, it was bullish trend. When bars were above MA, SMA5, it was bullish trend. Up to red circle. MA5 did bearish crossover. It was bearish reversal. Bearish reversal. After like six days, it did bullish crossover and now looks like you see this on RSI it did at the same time also but on RSI we already received bearish reversal sell signal SMA5 didn't make bearish crossover yet but last bar already moved below 20 whatever is above 20 it it, it was bullish trend bullish territory when bar is below 20 it is bearish territory. It's the first bar, first day we are below tw uh, 20. My rule is two bars. We need two bars close below 20. Like here you see, because one day it touched, next day it did bounce. Same here, touched, bounce, touched, bounce, touched, bounce. Same can, here, can be here, tomorrow it can bounce. Uh, if tomorrow will continue, will be second red bar. It means it it is confirmed bearish reversal. Minus three percent today. Today is December twenty sixth. Daily time frame for Bitcoin, right? Bearish reversal, bearish divergences. It wants to go bearish. Four hours time frame. Four hours time frame. It's already confirmed bearish reversal. SMA five. Moves below all moving averages except 200. Bars below all moving averages except 200. Bearish trend. One hour time frame for Bitcoin. Also bearish trend. Last bar below all moving averages. Bearish trend. It's actually on one hour you see it's a bearish trend. Let me show you. Price action. Price action is bearish and on RSI it has bullish, bullish divergence, right? It wants to bounce. It wants to bounce on one hour time frame. It has bullish divergence, but trend is bearish. Let's start Bitcoin Cash. One hour, similar story. One hour bearish, it's a bearish setup because you see SMA 20 did bearish crossover over 200, it is bearish setup. Same on Bitcoin, same bearish setup, SMA 20 did bearish crossover, SMA 50 did bearish crossover. Very negative setup. Bitcoin cash minus three and a quarter percent, one hour time frame, bearish trend. Four hours time frame, bearish trend, SMA 5 did bearish crossover. Bearish trend last bar below all moving averages. Daily time frame. All SMA 5, 10 and bars below all moving averages, even last bar except 200. You see the 
last bar it touched a SMA 200. It did touch before a SMA 200 and I did bounce from it. Will it bounce from it now? I don't think so because it was already touched three times. It, yeah, it definitely, it, usually it bounces first time, second time, and third time. And after that, it finally it can do and go through and do bearish, bearish crossover. Um, yeah, it's bearish, right, on daily, on all time frames. Ethereum, Ethereum minus two and a quarter percent. Let's see. Daily time frame, SMA5 still above SMA20, but last bar below SMA5, 10 and 20. It did touch SMA50. It can bounce from SMA50, but now it started bearish reversal sell signal on RSI and Hakanachi also. Four hours time frame, last bar touched SMA200. Bearish reversal, bearish trend. RSI was an overbought, oversold territory. Looks like it wants to bounce, but still bearish trend. One hour time frame. Bearish setup, SMA 20 did bearish crossover. Looks like it's from the oversold territory, it did bounce. Maybe it will bounce up to 20, it will touch 20 and will be rejected. So far, still bearish trend. Ethereum Classic minus three and a half percent. Minus three and a half percent daily time frame. Uh, SMA five still above SMA twenty. Last bar just moved below SMA five. SMA twenty started bearish reversal. Four hours time frame confirmed bearish reversal trend. SMA five. Bars did bearish crossover over 10 and 20 and 50. Bearish trend on all indicators. One hour time frame. One hour time frame, SMA 5, 10 and bars below 200. It is a bearish trend, bearish setup, bearish direction. Ada Cardano minus four and a half percent. One hour time frame, bearish crossover, bearish trend. SMA 20 ready for bearish crossover, bearish trend. Four hours time frame, same SMA 5 and bars move below all moving averages, bearish trend. RSI and Hikanachi also bearish. What's that? Also bearish, right? Daily time frame for Ada Cardano. Ada Cardano, yeah, bullish trend, it was bearish divergence. Sideways, Ada Cardano kind of minus four and a quarter percent, but it is still sideways. Sideways, it didn't move below 20. Today it did move below 20, but it bound, it, it, it recovered. It recovered. Uh, we need to wait until uh, bars and SMA5 move below 20, it will be confirmed bearish reversal. So far, it is still in the positive territory above SMA20. Right, on daily time frame. XRP, XRP minus 4% today, daily time frame. I uh, previous bar it was bullish for a four percent up and last bar four percent down. Very huge volatility. It yeah, it was below SMA 20, it was in the bearish territory. It did get a, a, above all moving averages and it came on daily. Actually, it's yesterday was bullish. Today it's completely reversed bearish. Yeah, yesterday was bullish, today completely reversed. Four hours time frame after the nice bull run, I did bearish reversal and last bar below all moving averages, bearish trend. Four hours time frame, bearish trend, last several bars they touched as MA200, SMA200 strong support, like it was over here. You see, here it was support, it did bounce from it. Second time it, it did bounce from it, and third one. Yeah, it's a, it was a lot of try, a lot of, yeah. On one hour time frame, it did kind of SMA 200, very strong support. 
so far the trend is bearish right trend is bearish on one hour and four hours daily it's still kind of positive uh, daily it's also bearish ton coin minus two or almost minus two and a half percent daily time frame sell signal last bar move below sma below all sma 5 10 and 20 50 and 100 below all moving averages except 200 bearish reversal on daily four hours last bar below all moving averages bearish trend one hour time frame last bar below all moving averages bearish trend on all indicators that's all very simple right very simple let's do summary uh, on daily time frame all crypto in my watch list they started bearish reversal signal but it's not confirmed yet on daily time frame but it's already confirmed bearish trend on four hours time frame for all crypto it's bearish and one hour time frame it's definitely already in bearish reversal trend bearish trend that's all let's move to my uh, disclaimer i'm not a financial advisor this video for educational and informational purposes only remember for educational purpose we are using paper training simulator thank you for watching simple training style videos i do publish daily weekly monthly updates for cryptos I also publish, publish daily updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Click like button to support this channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.